Driver didn't pick me up. I'm all pissed off. I'm out here. This is Monica. So, been um, been working all day. Super Bowl that Sunday. Had a couple of drinks. Anyway, I'm out. I actually have a date. Center an Uber. They'll pick me up. We're gonna go over to uh, Viva Loreles to get something to eat. Hopefully, she's a good looking young girl. Monica, 32 years old, Arizona. So that's gonna be interesting. Wish me luck. Check the Uber. Yep, she a little bit away. Volkswagen Golf. Volkswagen Golf. It's a beautiful night here in Loreles. City of eternal spring. Perfect weather. It's nice and warm today. No rain. Volkswagen Golf. Golf. I'm on a stay in a central commercial. No. So a little ticked off about my Uber driver. I sent a car to pick up my date and uh, I had a stop at my hotel to pick me up. And then we would go to we would go to the mall together. And the son of a bitch did not stop and pick me up, so I'm walking just taking an extra time out of my evening because I've been working like all day I have to work tonight and so he completely missed the stop didn't pay attention to the route I was supposed to make a stop at my hotel and pick me up so now I have to walk there it's actually kind of good I get a, I get some exercise because of it I sit all day So it's not bad and I get a fast, I'm a fast walker. So we're here, Viva Loreles in Loreles. Exit door. So there's a couple of restaurants here. And there's my man, Amit. We're gonna cut through the pharmacy. Cut through the pharmacy, I'm not buying any drugs today. It's actually a shortcut here. Instead of going all the way around to the door, I actually could have cut in through the parking garage. I gotta get one of these phone holders, so I gotta come back here to this little store. Get one of these phone holders for the for the desk for my phone. Hopefully my date is cute. So let's see. She, is. she might be outside, she might be inside. That's her. Ooh, nice ass. That's her in the uh, in the head headkerchief. She's a cutie. Hola. Hola. <laughs> Hablaste con el driver para no parar en mi hotel. No, it's like... very hot. I get there, I'm all sweaty. And so what you don't see, you see me in a video accusing her. <laughs> Bad Tony. Accusing her of uh, giving the driver, after the driver picks her up, giving the driver direction not to pick her up. And so in in my accusation, I accuse her of saying to the driver, don't go to the hotel. I don't want to go to Tony's hotel, you know, and just take me to the Comercial. What you don't see in the video is that we had a conversation. Um, she was very well aware, me and Monica, that she was aware that 
the Uber had to stop to pick me up at the hotel. And you don't see that in, in the conversation. So I'm even more livid and more furious and more accusational. Poor girl, right? I'm sorry, Monica. That I accuse her of telling the driver not to come to the hotel. She knew very well if the driver was to take her straight to the mall, to the Comercial, that she would say, no, you need to go and make a stop at the hotel and pick up Tony. So I, of course, of course, have to accuse someone because I'm furious with my time. Anyway, long story, I don't want to make this too long, but um, after accusing her and being really mean to her, berating her for several minutes, she actually turned out to be a pretty decent human being. Well, later she turned out to be not so decent. But anyway, that's another, another video. She actually turned out to be a, a very good human being and she uh, took it very well. Um, I guess she liked the date, she liked the meal, uh, where we went, the food and the company. Primera ubicación que había, o sea, no. había puesto primero. Dos. Esa de... Paradas. Yo, yo, yo espera, espera, era. espera. Eran las dos. El carro venía por mi hotel a recogerme. No. Mira, mira. Vea que no. está aquí medio. No, no, espera, es que espera, la voy a cambiar. Espera. Lo voy a, 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 a poner solo una, porque tú dices no al comercial, que ah, no querías no, ir al comercial. No, no, yo no le dije al nada. Ay, no, espera, mira. Cajera 57, inició. Ah, ¿Cuál okay. es la segunda? Antes ah, yo no sé, ¿Cuál? porque el que espera, yo... Espera, espera. A las 6 y 43, a Cajera 78A, que es mi hotel. Y después, aquí. Está ahí. 81, que es, que es aquí. ¿Entiendes? Okay, no sé, yo no sé, yo no cambié nada. Yo no sé. Okay. No sé. ¿Qué mierda que no paró sí, por mí sí. en mi hotel? Okay. So, anyway. The driver didn't pick me up. I'm all pissed off. I'm out here. I'm out here walking. I'm all sweaty. This is Monica. So she's a cutie. So good thing. Ya has visto, venido aquí a este? Sí. Mira, aquí tiene firehouse y el forno. ¿Cuál quieres? Okay, bueno. Dos, por favor. Podemos allá. So, ahí no, no. Ahí no. Ponga aquí. Bueno, siéntate tú aquí. Go so here, firehouse. I actually, I always eat next door. Uh, in forno italiano. Gracias. ¿Qué tienes de tomar de cocktails? Cocktails, bring the cocktail menu. El horno. Al término del juego. Um, ¿Puedo ordenar ahora? ¿Puedo ordenar ahora? Sí, claro. Ok. Bueno, ahora mismo. Y yo quiero un gin. ¿Qué? Un gin and tonic. Para mí. Eh... Este aquí, de Tangeray, está bien. Gin Tangeray. Gracias. Sí, gracias. So I ordered some fried food. Uh, I usually don't eat fried food. I got me a gin and tonic. Monica got a beautiful mojito. ¿Te gusta tu mojito? Me encanta. Te encanta tu mojito? Te gusta? Yeah, we're in a firehouse. And uh beautiful guapa. normal. Ah, normal. I'm Batman. <laughs> And this is Catwoman, Monica Catwoman. Vita. Kizzy. Catwoman. 
Okay, yeah, we're having fun. <laughs> you must start to English. How is your English, Monica? What? <laughs> Rico. Whoa, yeah. Gosala, que la vida es una. Gosala. Gosala, that means like live life. Gozar is like to live life to the best. Because life. Is this world or whatever? I don't know. Who's drinking? Monica, te gusta el jungle juice? Jungle juice? Me encanta. <laughs> <laughs> que se jungle juice. So, Monica, first time having a jungle juice. Te gusta el jungle juice, Monica? Gosala! Monica's going to jail. She's got the uh, stripes on. What? Eh, cuando vas a la cárcel, tienes la ropa de stripes. Antigamente se vestían... Se vestían así, pantalones también. Ay, sí, por de negro y blanco. Porque se te escapas de la prisión. El pueblo, el um, sabe que, que es prisionero. prisionero. No, es una prisionera. Yo soy prisionera. She is prisoner. <laughs> She's a prisoner. <laughs> ¿Qué dices, Mónica? ¿Qué dices? ¿Que no vas a salir? Que no, no me dejan salir, auxilio. Socorro. <laughs> Catuela. Catuela. Catwoman. Are you Catwoman? Catwoman. You Catwoman? Catuela. I <laughs> There's also a, a part of the conversation that's not in video where um, the way she's dressed, I tell her that she's Catwoman. And she didn't know. She doesn't know what that means. She doesn't speak English. And I guess um, when you watch the movie Catwoman here in Colombia or in Latin America, they don't call it by the English name Catwoman. Of course, because it's it's a Hollywood export, and so you would call it. You figure they would call it Catwoman, like Batman is Batman, right? Uh, and Spider Man is Spider Man. I guess Superman is Superman. Okay, so super is ubiquitous throughout the world. But Catwoman is not Catwoman here in Colombia. They call them, so I men mentioned to her, you're dressed in this black one piece suit. You look like Catwoman, like a very sexy Catwoman, which she was. And so she, finally, she doesn't know what Catwoman is. So I, I explained to her, you know, in the movies, this and this and that, and this is not on video, but then she comes out and says, Gatuela. So that's what they call Catwoman here in Colombia, Gatuela. Gatuela. So this is my date with Gatuela, where I become very accusational and very pissed, very livid, and behaving very badly. And it actually turned out to be a very, very nice person and took it very well. So, all right, thank you for watching my videos. Please subscribe. Um, please comment. Tell me how bad I behaved. Um, and um, give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Hey, Tony, you're bad. You're accusing a poor girl. Someone's at blame. I think it was her because of the conversation that we had. But it could be the driver too. But usually the drivers follow the stops and the app will punish you if you don't make the stop. So um, there's that whole thing where the application is guiding the driver. So I believe that she told the driver not to stop. It's my intuition. I'm usually right. Aloha.